bronies, uh, Z Pack and um and Tony Tony Lesbian Harvin, uh, whatever his name is, something like that. You know what I mean? Man, they be talking some stuff, boy. I'm gonna call your name, Tony Harvin. Mm. And Pasadena Jennings. First thing was I issued this this challenge out. It got answered. And then through that, you sitting there calling the people wild whores and thoughts and thoughts. Then you, Tony Harvin, coward, you coward. Then you turn around and you putting names of slaves and thoughts and all of that on holy righteous women photos. Israelites are right. That's why God divorced them in the Old Testament like they uh, to use. Hmm. He says meat lovers. What up the Michael Howard's words? Uh, I remember that he was live and speaking about Gina's wife and mom and he was drinking and had guns in the back and started talking crazy trying to act hard. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. You know? The man was talking uh, very ignorant. You know, and then when somebody uh, says something in a responsive manner, as far as like, you know, defense or how stupid he sounds or how silly his uh, those those women are, which is the truth. And they try to classify it as disrespect. How you are, uh, how you a so-called pastor drinking whiskey or whatever the case may be. You know what I mean? Use a profanity, disrespecting people's mothers and whatnot. And you call yourself a man of God? What man? Listen, what man of God got the Holy Ghost in him, preaching the word, but got a cup of whiskey? I don't get it. I don't get it at all. A cup, a cup of whiskey. I understand some wine. A lot of us, you know, you know, got an infirmity. You know, <laughs> our stomach hurt a little bit. You know, listen, we we get this much wine <laughs> and try to and try to justify our infirmity, but whiskey. Whatever you was drinking, you understand? On a live drunk. A pastor on a live drunk. So what you got guns in the background? Who cares? Who cares? I'm pretty sure some people got, got guns also on here for hunting purposes and things like that because that's what y'all do mainly is just hunt. You know what I mean? Or, or go, go to target practice. You're making it seem like you're a gangster or a thug out there. No. You got those guns for hunting, and you got those guns for target practice. You don't got them for human beings in a sense, besides if somebody was to break in your house, whatever the case may be, for that purpose. But for the most part, just hunting and target practice. That's it. You know what I mean? You're not a gangster. You're not a tough guy or whatever the case may be. That's just it. All right? You got that clear. Okay? Um, 